Okay, so today we're going to do a quick review on these lidocaine patches, 4% made by Solampus. These are maximum strength, meaning this is the maximum strength of lidocaine that you can get without a prescription. So this package comes with six patches, and let's take one out and look at it. Now one of the things I like about this right away is that they're individually packaged. I can easily slide it in my pocket and I can use it if I need to later on in the day. Also like that it's a child proof pack, meaning you have to have a pair of scissors to cut these open. You just can't tear these. Okay, I'm actually going to take this out of the package here in just a minute, but quickly I want to touch on a few things. It's very important. Number one is that this patch is good for eight hours. Okay, it's real good for the majority of your work day. Another thing I like is this is a gel patch. This is a little bit different than regular adhesive. That means that it's more flexible and the adhesive is a little bit more gentler on your skin. Okay, the other thing I like about it, look at this, it is unscented. That's very important to me because I don't want to go around smelling the high heavens when I put something like this on. Okay, let's grab the box again. I want to show you a couple of things. You wouldn't think this is important, but the patch itself has rounded corners, which actually means that it's not going to catch on your clothes as easy and be pulled away when you're wearing it throughout the day. You can't appreciate this unless you try to wear this all day long, but the rounded corners do make a difference. Other patches have regular square sharp corners, which get caught on your clothing. Here's a quick shot at the back of the box. Of course, it says lidocaine 4% because that's what this is. This is a 4% lidocaine patch and it is for temporary relief of pain, just like it says. A couple of highlights about the warnings I want to go over with you. Number one, don't use more than one patch at a time. Yes, I know. I've heard people say that they can use two or more. It's not the end of the world, but if you do, I would just be careful. I would just recommend using one at the time. Where you might be able to use two at a time is that if you use one, say, on one area of your body, and another on another area of your body. I wouldn't put two side by side on any part of your body. Don't put it on any open wounds. Of course, that's kind of common sense, but you may not think so if you have like a little scratch or something. You don't want this getting into your bloodstream because you may have a reaction there. Some people don't think about this, but I use a heating pad at night, okay? You don't want to use this while you're laying on your heating pad. Only other thing I want to hit on real quick, and you can look at the label for yourself. Don't use this on a child under 12 years of age, unless you talk with the doctor first. I'm not saying that you can't use it on a child, but I would suggest talking to the doctor first. Okay, so what qualifies me to be able to talk to you about a patch like this? Well, I've had back pain for many years, over half my life. And as I've gotten older, I've actually started to develop joint pain in my shoulders, in my elbows, in my knees in particular. So on the days that I need it in other places other than my back, it comes in handy. I wish I had discovered this a little bit earlier in life because it really does help the pain. Now, one very important thing that I want to get across to you, this does not cure anything. This is a numbing agent. Matter of fact, it says it right on the box. It is a numbing agent. It doesn't cure anything. But that's fine with me. As long as it helps the pain, I don't care what you call it. It numbs the pain. It really helps target nerve pain, which I've really started to have a problem with. And what it's really designed to do is desensitize aggravated nerves. Okay, real quick, let me tell you about the size of the patch before I take one out. So you're looking at five and a half inches the long way. And on the short side, just at four inches, maybe slightly under. And so since the majority of the time I put these patches on my lower back, I actually have my wife come in and help me put them on. I can put them on by myself, but it's so much easier if she's around. So I'm going to invite her in and I'm actually going to show you how she helps me put this patch on. Okay, so you can see I'm cutting it open with a pair of scissors and pulling the patch out, taking a look at it. It's that nice gel patch like what we were talking about. Okay, all you do is you open it up and you just kind of pull and the backing comes right apart comes off very easily you just peel it off kind of like a band-aid this adhesive is very gentle i really like it it does not give me a reaction okay here i'm pointing to my wife telling her okay this is where the pain is and she puts it on smooths it out and that's all it is to it very quick process so there you go i've got the patch on and it's with me for the day it's going to last me eight hours i fully expect it i'm going to be particularly active today so i know i'm going to need it i don't wear it every day but it's nice to have it and like i've touched on earlier as i've gotten in my older years i really have started developing pains in areas of my body that have just started showing up 
So these patches really do help me. I don't like going to the doctor unless I really need to. I don't have to have a prescription for this, so that is top on my list. So I'm thrilled that I found something like this that helps me through the day without having to take the time to go see a doctor to get a prescription for something. And whether I need this for my back, my shoulder, my elbow, my knee, I can alternate days that I use it on different areas of my body. What I do personally is I put it on the part of my body that hurts the worst that day. And one huge advantage of having a lidocaine patch like this is that that is one less pain pill that you have to take. There's times you can take ibuprofen for things or aspirin for things, but then there's other times where you're just tired of taking medicine all the time. And this is something that you can actually put on the outside of your body, apply it to a targeted place, and it really helps. I wouldn't recommend it if I wasn't so passionate about the results that I get from it. So I hope this review educates you a little bit and it makes you a little bit more confident about trying something like this. You really don't have much to lose by trying it, except for the pain, of course.